Hey guys, and welcome back to the stream. Um, we were playing Jurassic Park, well, Jurassic World Evolution last time. Now, that was a very popular game that came out last year. So, we were up to producing dinosaurs and all that good stuff. We've got this flock of little guys here. They're pretty cool. Oh, and we had to go through so much boring intros as everyone decided to introduce themselves to me in one go in the first island. So, we had, like, the guy of security and all that sort of stuff. So they want us to incubate Triceratopsis now. So I feel the next step will be to, yeah, get some trikes out there. Now we'll go to this screen, this screen, and we'll send off an expedition. There's not already one in the works. There is one in the works. It's great. Uh, are we researching? Yes, we are. We've got to push forward that researching. It is so much effort to keep it going, but it's so worth it all at the same time. Definitely worth it. Okay, so we'll push forward the researching now. There we go. One more item done. I'm going to do fences real quick. So we don't have luxury fences yet. And trucks can be really temperamental, if I remember correctly. So, <laughs> we'll just push forward that, I think. I feel that's actually not a bad idea. This game has a lot of, like, downtime as you're waiting for things to complete, or hatch, or raise. Yeah, it's a great game, like, super in-depth. Me and my friend played it when it first came out, and we loved the hell out of it. We had it pre-ordered. Oh, it was so dirty. Because I had it on Xbox, and he had it on PS4. Now, PS4 actually released it at midnight, so... And I finished work at midnight, because, uh, like, I was... Night feel so I finished at midnight and that, and he could play it right on the dot when I finished work, and mine didn't release until the morning, like <laughs> mine didn't release till the morning at like ten o'clock or something. It was so so bad. Oh my god! But he was a really nice guy and he didn't actually play. <laughs> and I was like, oh, you don't have to, <laughs> but I really appreciate this. <laughs> Uh, we can't have another contract where we got birthing miracle or successfully incubate three triceratopses, extract a fossil DNA into a dinosaur to at least 50%. Okay, so we're going to be digging, 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 researching, researching. That's basically the idea here. That's alright, it's a great game to start off with. Something slow and low paced. Okay, so we've got electrified steel fences coming up. Okay, what have we got here? Fossil setup, view fossil. That's going nice. Now yeah, have upgrades, we have upgrades. Inventory space. Sure, I'll buy you inventory space. I think that's the only upgrade I currently have, so I'll just buy three of that. Uh, research center, view upgrade. Research, nearly done. Okay, pretty cool. Lazy start of a day. What have we got over here? Ranger station. Uh, I suppose I should tell them to go feed everybody and make sure I don't have a dinosaur riot. It's probably a good idea. Rangers, Ranger Team 1, add task. Why isn't the feeding trust coming up as a, a task? I guess because they're full, maybe? Maybe? Uh, 9 out of 10. Okay, so on the Xbox, um, even if they're like one thing left, you can just feed them anyway. So that's actually interesting. Uh, I've got emergency shelters. I could literally click this off right now and kick off an emergency if I wanted to. That's something I could definitely do. But I won't. Okay, what have we else we got? We have... Do 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 New fossils. Yes, I will extract that and I'll extract that and oh god I want more dig teams. <laughs> so I got that new DLC as well, the Ceratasis pack, whatever it was called. It's meant to add more dinosaurs. So I feel I would just go and do some crazy digging. We'll bring our park right now. Um, I want tracks. So 
so I can achieve that, but uh, if we go to here, empty slot, we have success rate increase. So I guess that's important. And I think that might be our only research for that one as well. So, well, maybe? We definitely want success rate in this one. Carnivals are expensive. Okay, success rate, success rate, success rate, done. Electrified field research is done. We have electrified fences. Very, very good. Okay, so I'm going to research guns. Guns, ladder. Okay, I will go here. I don't need the helicopter. I need the plant itself. Uh, accuracy, sure. I'll pay for an accuracy. I'll pay for another accuracy. Paint. Ooh, what skins do we have? We have just the classic. On Xbox, you've got a few skins to pick between, so that's interesting that the PC didn't have them for, the, for this one, but that's alright. Uh, did they have the classic Jeep? Did they have the classic Jeep? Oh, look at all the Jeeps. That's so cool. Okay. Very, very cool. Alright, so I'm going to go in here and here. Now, what just happened? Was that a research? That was a research. That was a fast research, is what that was. Okay, really, really good. Ah, uh, we're digging. Yeah, we're digging. Keep it all going. What's our new notes while we're looking at stuff? This guy. There's a large dinosaur, a duck billed dinosaur. Lived in the western region where it was found. Okay, so you're the father of all ducks. <laughs> Very large duck. That's great, because we've got so many pet ducks here, so we can fit just right. Large bonus reel and three horns. Mega Triceratops. Now, which one was wrong? Like, apparently, what, the Brontosaurus didn't exist. Is only the Brachiosaurus existed or something like that? So, yeah. There's all these kind of things. But, Jurassic Park simplified it all in their movies to... Uh, Try to make people more invested, more so than anything else. Now we want try. So I'm gonna go dig there. Go, go, go! Okay, so if we go to here, we'll sell that. Extract that. Extract that. Nice. Okay. Oh, that guy, the Hugomonus or whatever. That thing is so painful. It just goes on a rampage, breaking everything. It, it's all it wants to do. Assess it. Containment. What, what did we just research before? Hmm. Okay. Ranger station upgrades. Not bad. Okay. So we're going here. What do we got here? You do not have enough research teams to research the Alpine. Ooh, we make them look at Alpine. Pretty much, we got to get a park rating up to four before we can move on to the next island. Now, each island's really important because they reduce more and more dinosaurs, more and more attractions. It's so much easier to even everything out later than it is to even everything out now. So, that's sort of my goal at this point. Man, these headsets are good. I always think something's to my left. I hear clack, 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 and it's just always making me look. I, I'm pretty sure it's the screen. I mean, there's. I don't know what it is. It's something in the game. It, it only comes up with a metal left headset, so it freaks me out. <laughs> Good old razors, right? Um, done some park formation. What do we got over here? Yeah, stuff to sell, stuff to sell. Archive characters. Owen Grady. George Lampert, otherwise known as Star Lord. <laughs> Ian Malcolm, Karen Mitchell, Tim Murphy, Dennis Murphy, Roland Hemper. Okay, go back into here. And let's research that. Uh, I don't want the helicopter. Thanks, though. Let's have a look. Accuracy. Uh, scheduling. Scheduling. And reloading. 
You've done some impressive work. And I thought I was the only competent one around here. So which, which one's out of power? Where was the out of power? Can I see where the out of power is? Yes, you can. You go to this view. Oh, they sabotage the station again. The same power station, seriously. Like, and we'll go for the same one. Good job, guys. Okay, add a task. Go fix it. Uh, so we go to here, we go to here, we saw that, extract that. We have so many power stations uh, that when one goes down, we literally just don't care. Everyone just keeps working. It's like when. Ah, the stream's going good. I don't see that up in the chat still, so I haven't fixed that yet. But I guess that's alright. Like, yeah, I, I've got the chat open on the phone, so. Kinda works. <laughs> Okay, let's have a bit of a look around. No power. Well, no power to what? Show me what there's no power to. Which is, uh, let's have a look at what's going on screen. Is it in here? Don't know where to go. Click for that. And I found it yesterday, and now it's all gone again. Look, ah, that one. Management views. Okay, so power. Weather. Blue, low needed. What's this? Very need high. Okay, the sh <laughs> the hotel wants its own shelter. <laughs> Traction fences, finances. Okay, so what's that one? Uh, upkeep red. So what about that one? That clothing shop is not producing money. It's terrible, apparently. Um, yep, 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 yep. Ah, mm. oh, okay. That's actually really interesting though. They want like something down here towards this thing. That makes actually a lot of sense. So if I go to this clothing shop and I go boom boom boom. It's not making any money, not making anything. I could just get rid of it. Uh, new day, just, new show, yeah, new security. contract. You are definitely gonna All wanna right, check so it out. We'll what? Ah no, not that. Not the road. Not the road. Oh, damn it. Um, that's not good. That's really not good. Uh, let's build a road back, I guess. These guys are walking on grass now. Alright. So these guys down here want a shelter. And they want someone to go eat and drink. So we can arrange that. We'll put, like, a Ben and Jerry's out front of the house. Uh, how do I... Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. I think the best I could do would be try to whack it in here, maybe. Give me a second to go. I swear to God, there we go. Blue there. Okay, so if I run a road to that now. Where is its entrance? No. I don't actually see its entrance anywhere. Something? Must be. Yep, that did it. Okay, sweet. Alright, so it needs power as well. How annoying. Okay, so it's got power, it's got food, it, it, it's gonna have a whole heap of stuff. That'd be great. Um, what should we have it sell? Dynabots maybe? Dynabots again? Always Dynabots, right. Oh, we're busy working on our scientists. We got fossils. Yay! Okay, so the truck's looking a lot better. It's really good. Okay. Alright, so this is open now. I'll have it sell the dino dish for 20 bucks. And I'll put more stuff on. Holy crap, look at the income from this. And it crashed. <laughs> no! God damn it, market. Why'd you crash? Serving 116 people. Like, wow. Just, just wow. It says less if you turn it up one dollar. I think I crashed it out. Uh, how much did the dining dish cost? Six dollars. 
there's 90 people in there now. I, I bugged it. I was sitting on the perfect numbers and I just went, oh, how much more money can I grind out of people? Now it's having 92 people. So we'll try just leaving it at 20. We'll see what happens. Uh, I should put a manager in charge, right? No, screw it. Who wants a manager? More money means even bigger and better shows. Okay. That's all good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know that. I know that. You know that. We we want more money. More money, more problems, right? Uh, contracts. New contract. Give me an entertainment contract because we're nearly there. Hey. Just heard of a great opportunity we build should get behind. Build and connect a clothing shop. Okay, well we will build and connect a clothing shop. The more buildings we have, the more chance to increase our revenue. We'll put it near here. Because why not? And we'll just have it attached via here. Hey, clothing shop. Oh, they want trucks. Very tempted to make their trucks for them now. Oh, look at that. More DNA for the truck. Now, what did we do over here again? Was it... No, we don't have reactors yet. So we'll just literally pop out a whole heap of them instead. Very, very good. Okay, very happy with that. Uh, no dick speeds. Your rep is buying you cred with everyone in entertainment, including me. Buying me cred, right? Buying me cred. Okay. Uh, it's all because those damn media is all we got. Anybody who thinks creating entertainment with dangerous creatures hundreds of millions of years old is easy is crazy. Oh, we know that. making it look easy. I think this is the last one for this island. Maybe. Uh, well, that contract just completed. That give me I'm just gonna come out and say it. You and I make a what? heck of a team. team. That research just completed. So we'll go here. We'll go here, and we'll research that. And before we know it, everything's coming together, right? We'll only have those to research next, which are like cosmetics, like making them smarter, and increases your, like, you know, your park attractions, and that. It's really good. Okay, um, should we push out some trikes? Worst case scenario is we sell the trikes, right? So we'll push out some trikes. The Triceratops, one of people's favorite dinosaurs. Favorite of someone I even know in real life. Good old Adrian, he likes the trike. Why are we selling shirts? $25 shirts, thank you. We'll sell $25 shirts, why not? I'll take another person on. Because that usually helps flush it out a little bit. Uh, maybe not this time. Yeah, that's not helping me at all. How about a $21 shirt? It's a bargain. It's a steal at $21. I want to take this contract, which means you want to take it too. Yeah, we might have to run up side soon. We'll see how we go though. Because everything you unlock, I like, this is one thing I didn't find out at the start of the game too, like, because you run out one thing that keeps giving you unlocks and new stuff. Now, they try to make you sound like you should only pick one and go for it, and be like that for the whole game. But literally each one has like a heap of unlocks just for one thing. So if you go in and you spend your time doing it all properly, you'll actually get a whole heap of stuff. If you go through and do each faction separately. Creation Lab. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, let's go. We'll watch our first trike. Oh, yeah. We'll call him Barry. Barry the trike. Look at that beautiful thing. I see you 
patch of Triceratops. Might be cute now, but that's only gonna last for about a week. He's content. So they're happy on their own, but we need three of them. Might be cute now, but that's only gonna last for, for about a week. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna have to get rid of some of this truth and minuses, I feel. Because this compound's gonna get really overcrowded really fast. You guys happy? Okay. All that population is really high. Ugh. Super high population. Yeah, we're gonna have to get rid of maybe some of the fuzzy guys. Maybe. It's like the only thing I can think of doing. Get rid of some of this fruit and minuses. They were a little bit of money on early on though, so it's gonna be painful. But let's do this. Okay, I see you at the task. Not alone on this island. Achievement unlocked. I don't know what that means. But sure. Confirming task. Let's sell Elsa. We'll sell Edmund. And we'll sell no that problem. one. We'll sell all three then. Okay. Okay. Yes, Site C, more commonly known as Isla Muerta. A newly developed island. The name, roughly translated, and I do mean roughly, the island of the dead. Fitting. Humorous, even. Island of the dead. Dangerous diseases. We need team management tropical storms. Let's stay here for now. Because we haven't finished researching everything in that. And we might as well do that on an established part instead of grinding our way up through a very painful push into the next part. Alright, so we need to sell a few of those guys. Did he die? No, he's not died. Why well, viability upgrade by 30%? Nice, it actually says that on here. Didn't actually say that on the Xbox either. So that's pretty cool. And we got the next one. Keep this up and the sky's the limit. Oh, structure's broken. What structure's broken? Why is there a structure broken? Okay. On route to collect the asset. Collecting asset. Asset required collection. Okay, so what's broken? How do I see this again? It was like the view screen was God damn it. Not good. What's broken? Come on. Ah. It's a power station that's broken? Ah, oh, sabotage. Of course it's sabotaged. They didn't they didn't sabotage a crappy one this time, they sabotaged a good one, one that actually does stuff. Well, there we go. We'll fix this one. Sabotage resolved. There we go. Back online. Nice and safe. All good. Alright, so we have our three tracks. And... I think that's it for the reputation. Right? Yep, yeah, that's it. Okay, so... Oh, what's this? Down here. Reputation reward achieved. The sign of Ceratops. Okay. So I suppose it's time for us to go running down here, maybe? Incubating the shooting speed. Yeah, science center. A dinosaur. Joe's down here. Security protocols. Tooth hardness. Okay. So if you don't run all the organizations up around about equal, you end up getting sabotaged a fair bit. But that's fine, because it's kind of meant to happen that way. I'm going to start a new contract. I'm going to talk to the scientist ship. I just heard of a new contract that I and think will be I'm beneficial for the science division. And then I'm going to that one. Yeah. I'm not asking out of loyalty. There's plenty okay, for you so what here you as want? well. Obtain a fossil. That's going to be easy. Extract because I'm already getting them. 
Now, which fossil did she want? She wanted the Dracorex. Of course she wants the, the Dracorex. The most bloody hardest one to deal with, because it's so annoying. It, it's just like, I'm frustrated all the time this time, so, so bad. So, so bad. Okay, Drax, you feel better? Me do. Few cyanoterraces going is exactly what you want. You guys are happy now. Very, very good. Extremely good. Okay. So we were four star, and we're not now. Don't ask me when that dropped again. Fair enough. Um, Ranger Station, yes. Let's chuck a. We're going to get eaten building down. Obstructed, 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 obstructed. Oh, and a path. Thank you. Come on. Give me a path among the gum trees. With lots of plum trees. A box or two. Oh, we don't always back. get offers like this. Consider it carefully. Yeah, I know. I need to run down security as well. So I guess I'll bother with that as well. There we go. Uh, photograph a dinosaur running. Oh, that's going to be painful. Where is my rangers? Kind of a two. Reload speed done. Accuracy done. Accuracy done. Scheduling done. And load speed. Oh, accuracy. Okay. Alright, now. So obtaining Dracorex fossil is what we're doing now. We finish the research. That's great. Uh, we'll make something smarter, shall we? So they want a Struth and Minus. A really, really tough Struth and Minus. Resilience of 48 on a Struth and Minus. Let's see what we can do about that. Uh, bo -bo -bo. Wait. Is this resilience already 50? Wait. That's already 50. Okay, so just build a truth of minus. We can do that. Done. <laughs> so hard. <laughs> wow. Okay. Get the fossil. Keep digging, just keep digging, just keep digging, just keep digging. We got some tricycles. I never doubted you, which is to say, I, I did have some doubt, but you come through, doubt. so thanks. All right, and next we will do. Some more digging. Now we need a new contract. We'll save though, because, well, now's a good time to do it. So here we are, we're saving anyway. Whew. Okay, so if I go in here now and I go to. Uh, contracts. New contract. Request contract. And they are talking to us. I want one from the science labs. The science division has Player something you should space. take a look okay. at. If you'd be so, so they kind. want inventory space at. Where is that? Fossil place, which is here, I think. No, that's dig speed. What was that? That's expedition center. Is that the fossil center? Okay, so I'm going to remove one of those. Done. With what you've been that was easy. To accomplish, <laughs> we can advance our work here in the science division. Okay, science is going up. No matter what anyone else says, science is what makes or breaks us. Admittedly, sometimes both. But on Isla Matanceros, you are making us and yourself Damn. look good. And that's worth a reward. Okay, so we want to do research now. Of course, something else is down. Go to Snarl Power Station 2. Car number 2, please. 
bring your team to at a task. Sick dinosaurs can become potentially dangerous dinosaurs. You are up now, in the risk factor in the facility. Who's infected? Who is infected? Dedicate that guy and then do that. Okay, done. And I will guess I'll just go get the um cars after they're done and take a photo. Because I have no real choice there. They're busy now. Ah, uh, they're digging. Okay. Alright, uh, I want a new contract. Can I get one? Nope. Cannot get a new contract. New fossils. Yay! Sell that. Extract that. Extract that. Go to the exhibition map and dig up more stuff. So we're only doing around about another 20 more minutes of Jurassic Park and then I think I'll try a few different games and see how they all play differently. So we'll be right back in like 20 minutes or so and we'll try something else and then maybe Civilization, I kind of feel like Civilization. Um, it's a great game, Civilization 6 is a great game. I don't have Gathering Storm, I'm not sure whether Gathering Storm's come out or not. But no it's, it's really dinosaurs good. Detected. Okay, so is one of these ranger teams done? Resupplying, resupplying, no. Well, we'll just buy a new team then, I guess. There we go. Now, I could drive this like a maniac. Let's go! Oh, hey, people! Why is she get stuck under my wheel? Why? Die! Die! Hey, uh-huh. You can't turn the car if you want Although, there is a really cool unlock. Ooh, uh, something. Uh, yep, yeah, I think that's our last research, too. Oh, no, there's a fossil research here. Alright, let's go! There is a research for, um, well, there's an unlock for, um, probably jumping really high in the car. And then there's another unlock for. What was the other unlock for? Skidding or driving around or something, I don't know. There's a few other mobs. I want a bit more pace. We're gonna follow this road along. Then we're just gonna like hammer right down it and see whether we get the skin. I think it's the classic car skin program correctly. It would be great. Everyone loves the classic Jeep from the original movie. Whee! Nope. We found a power station though. <laughs> Okay, I'm just going to go and try skidding. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. Now, apparently we need to do something boring, like take photos of a dinosaur anyway. So, I guess we'll just head this way. Take a photo of a dinosaur running. Open the gate! <laughs> Okay, I will head in here. We have five million. Maybe we can't bring any of that money onto the next one. Let's take a photo. F. Where am I? There's one running right now. Did that count? Yes, it counted. Done. That was easy. Dabbled in photography. Nothing as good as this, mind you. Dangerous models. Take a photo. Thanks to you, we have the pictures we need. Job done and contract, contract closed. closed. All right. Ah, get out of my way, people! Ah. It's like how you can't kill anybody. <laughs> Die! They'll like bail out of the way to Sarker. Alright, I'm going to try this big jump again. A bit more of a run up, I think. Kids, keep it going. <laughs> okay, if anything was going to do it, that was going to do it. Alright, done. Uh, I need younger, to I prayed for opportunities, you know, opportunities like the one okay. that just crossed no my desk. Take that and as a And let's go here. 
Pom 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 Dig again, let's go dig. Alright. And I guess we'll order a new contract. We want a research contract. You can help with this. And you should. Or was that just we can create a small hope wall? Okay, we can do that. Let's sell one first, shall we? Who do we not like? We sold Elsa, we sold Edmund. Is there Charlie in there? Uh... Setting additional oh wait, no, no, not that guy. He's a try. Oh, I love the soundtrack for this game so much. There's Stan. We'll sell Stan. Okay, so we need to use Truth and Minus. Oh! Literally, we're gonna get two here in one go, but look at it. Okay, we just need to sell some of these Truth and Minus first. Look at the graphics, it's just so, so nice. So, so nice. So nice. And he's gone. Sell that one. Uh, yep. Okay. Release. Release. The science division thanks you. So do I. Yep, that did that one, that did that one. Alright. So what is our reputation rewards for running up this tree? Really great uh, job on that contract. Uh, yeah, research complete, research complete, science center. We get and then we get a dinosaur. Okay. Threat mission security protocols, threat mission prehistoric life. We must have done that one. We haven't done that one yet, but look at it. No, we haven't done anything with security yet. Um, let's dig. Do a little bit more digging. Just keep moving, just keep moving. Don't dig me up with D immediately. Oh, actually, that's not what we're doing. We are researching this new fossil that we have, because apparently we have a new one unlocked, which is the Sinoterrorops. Yeah, okay. And it tells you that it came from the rep reward for entertainment on this area, which is really cool. Good job. I love these trikes. Absolutely beautiful. So cool. You are making the entertainment division the crown jewel of this entire operation. Is it meant to be a dinosaur asleep there that I haven't sold? Heading to pick up the asset. I want to sell that before it dies randomly. <laughs> so I've released both those. Can I get a new contract yet? Yay! Let's get a new contract. New science chick. Check this out. out. A new contract that I think you're really gonna Sarah like. Taurus. So, isn't that the meat eater? I'm pretty sure that's the meat eater. We have a resilience of 41. Okay, so this guy. Oh, wait, what's his resilience now? 34. Okay, so he has got a terrible, terrible resilience. Now, I'm pretty sure that goes up as we dig up their um, fallen world fossil access. That's so cool. Apply that. Yeah, just down to these. Oh, I've seen rating by like a lot though to change his color. We could do that. Why not? So, lifespan goes up by a heap. Viability goes down. His rating goes down. Resilience goes down. Resilience says is. Resilience goes down. So, it looks like the bird is probably the best one out of that one. Okay, so the one we have applied is probably the best one. Um, hardness brings up the 34, 41. 41 was our target, I think. I'm just 
gonna go to over here as well and make sure. So what's that? That goes up to 42. So if we do that, it goes up to 42. So okay, done. Done, 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 done. No problem. Um, if we incubate one of these guys now, what are, what's their stuff like? Are they happy? Like, are, are they gonna have like a murderous rampage when they start digging? What was that? Huh. Cool. But it wasn't anything. Cancel that. Yeah. We'll just cancel it. You can actually cancel on the computer, which is really good, because you couldn't cancel on the Xbox. It was so painful. Um, so I'm going to try building one now. Same percent viability. Why not? Okay, so this should do that one. Just going to save real quick, because we're making really good progress. Like, we're steamrolling this. This is great. Absolutely great. Entertainment's done. Entertainment's usually the worst one, because science just has a whole lot of talk to me and do this and hatch this and, like, modify this guy, which is fine. That's great. No problem. Uh, security has a whole lot of make this fight with this, though. So, curious how that's going to go. Okay, so there's already two in here. And their social is pretty damn full. What we... Oh, look at that. He's got a crown on him representing that he's, um... Something special. I wonder if I can hatch another one. We should just try it, right? It's better than trying to just sell one, knock one out, and sell it. Are they talking to each other? They are. Okay. Pretty cool. We just gotta wait for this now, which will take a little bit of time. Is all the research done then? Because if all the research is done, then we're getting really close to... Yeah, okay, so we, have, we haven't got that to worry about anymore. Now it's just literally sending digging expeditions. Digging up a bit more fossils, trying to get some of these genomes to 100%. Which isn't that big of a deal, it's pretty good. Pretty easy to do. Look at this pack of guys going through the water. They're not like a sparrow that lands in water and drowns. <laughs> Poor little guy. Uh, what have we got? We got these guys. They're pretty cool. We don't have any of them yet. What's our um social app for these guys? They can handle a couple of new dinosaurs, but like when I say a couple, literally like two. Hello, new contract time. Oh wait, I don't want that one. Terminate. Done. What's a new one? Science, please. Now this contract is something special. And continuous and as well. Just the person. As long as I don't get hit by a power outage or a sabotage, that. I should be right. Um, we'll do that and we'll do that and we'll see what that looks like. If there's any problems, you just start selling them. I want the ducks. He doesn't want ducks. They always look like they're smiling in evil in slight ways, but always look like they're smiling. Well, there we go. Already failed. <laughs> uh, T1. Do you want to go and deal with that sabotage? Just over here at this unused power station. Good luck. Comes back, he's like the black guy from the main movie that will end up getting even like you just find his arm sitting through a bar somewhere. <laughs> oh well we're waiting. We might as well, right? Let's go! <laughs> Take that! And that! And that! Okay, let's just get good at this, shall we? Apparently you can't die humans. What a shame. 
Ah, uh, back. Alright, release. Let's have a look at our duck, shall we? Oh, look at it, it's got a green head. The Edmontosaurus was originally uncovered at a site in Canada. I'll let you guess where. The T-Rex thinks these are delicious. And who's to argue? That was fine. Okay. Letting two of these little suckers go was absolutely fine. No one minded. Like us, different dinosaurs require different diets. So Make trying sure to tell me a tutorial about feeders. We've been using them like enclosure. literally for like nearly three hours. I'm a red meat man myself. <laughs> <laughs> we are pleased to welcome an Edmontosaurus to the park. Edmontosaurus. It's actually really cool. Okay. Well, here's. This should be interesting. We'll release this big, very annoying, mad dinosaur, shall we? He's got a pattern, unlike any other one. Got sharp teeth. More DNA. And he's probably gonna kill one of his cellmates. It's a balancing act. I get it. We all do. My point is, you need to provide the, the right amount of space bad, for actually. dinosaurs. This small enclosure ain't cutting it. As we improve our capability to create these dinosaurs, we can create more stable communities of animals. True resurrection is at hand oh, if we are willing look at her voice. to embrace it. VO contract blah 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 blah. Like it wasn't even like her name. It was just like a random contract title. I think he's going to be good, because that's so slow, even though it's really full. Actually, isn't that bad. His comfort's 100%. I think I managed to sneak him in. Like, I really do. I think I managed to just, just barely sneak him in. So, I'll, I'll live with that, and let's... I really like uh, this one. So I think he will, too. Nice At least 11. Ooh, an 11 Truth of Midas. Okay. That's going to be interesting. Let's save just in case he isn't 100%, but he looks like he will be 100%. Looks like he's so comfortable with the other ones. He's like, I'm the pack leader now. Rawr! Okay, view genome library. So, what's his current rating at? Um, nine. Okay. So if we make him pretty, oh so pretty, that turns him into 11. Done. Just make him pretty, is all I want. Where's his lifespan? 60. One of these increases the lifespan by a bit, doesn't it? Yeah, that one gives him 90. That gives him 66. 68. 68. Viability minus. And that brings up his rating again. Okay. So let's go with cosmetics, shall we? Because that automatically makes his rating 11. Then we'll apply that, which brings his rating up a little bit more, but more importantly, any future ones, it only costs 10 grand more, will live a little bit longer. So even a little bit longer means a little bit more time before you have to like, you know, kill them. <laughs> we can do this anyway. Uh, what's next? This is it, we're working on the last tier now. So then we just gotta run up 
the fighting one, basically the pit fighting one, the security one. <laughs> yeah, so I call it the pit fighting one because all of its missions are literally, let this fight with that, make sure this fights, make that fight with this. And literally it does actually raise their rating if they're like constantly fighting because I guess people like fighting. Now I need to get this guy before he runs away. Because I need to sell that one. Need to sell that one. Uh, you there. I need you to knock out this guy who just came out. That one. Confirmed. Don't let him go. Don't let him go. You need to get him. See, this is why it's a good idea. Build, like, small holding cells. So they release into, like, a small holding pen with a bit of water and that in it. And then you um, can do what you want with the marker. So you really got idea to do it that way. Instead of the way I'm currently doing it. Okay. Sell. Done. And that should complete that one. It should. Put forward my science up a little bit more. Oh. Security guys still wants a lot of stuff done. Like, a lot of stuff done. I don't know, maybe we should finish off running up security guy, and then... Like, we're, we're almost done science. If we finish off security guy, then this island's pretty much done. All we gotta do is run up security guy, because he gives you better fences and things, which is pretty important, really. You are nowhere near it. Did you knock out two? Like, I think you knocked out two. I'm very sure you just knocked out two. You did. Okay, so apparently it knocks out two when you mouse over. So I sold a random one who was just very unlucky enough to get caught in it. Now, I'm going to extend it a little bit longer than I was intending to, because I feel if I just iron out this other contract as fast as I can, I'll at least be able to start in New Island next time. Which will be a lot of fun. New Island's really, really good. So, we need to run up security next. And if we have two more minutes of uninterrupted power, and we sell this guy with the rating of 19, it should all work out, really. There's no reason why it shouldn't. Bye, little fella. Good luck in your new home. Commencing asset transit. Yeah, go, go. Take him to his new home. Goodbye. Yep, that one counted. Keep up this kind of work, and you'll be going places. Is that it? Did we get there? Yeah, we got there. Okay. Very, very good. Now we're going to research that one. Where's that one? There. Deluxe fossil access. Okay, so that was one of the deluxe fossils I got from having the deluxe edition. And Fallen Kingdom was a DLC that they added. So, those weren't really there before. No wonder I don't really remember doing these last ones. That's alright. I will just extract those two. I'll come back here and I'm going to dig up more meat eaters. Alright. Time to run up security, right? Alright, security. Take a security contract. Our existence is the constant Fire evaluation reduce upkeep. of threats Zero, and opportunities. One, two, this looks like a good opportunity. Reduce upkeep. Okay, we can do that. You there. Reduce upkeep. Remove. Reduce upkeep. Add. Done. Bottom line, I couldn't have done it any better. Thanks. 
So we really should cancel that one before it completes, because it's just going to hurt my security risk that I'm now trying to run up. So we'll just get rid of that, real quick. Oof, now we need a new contract. Security! We have nine million dollars. Why can't we move any of this money across to the next island? Seriously. <laughs> How is that one going? Wow. You have like four people buying Jurassic novels from you. Terrible. Is it just because they cost too much? How much do they cost me? Ten. I'll make it like eighteen. You don't need the staff. I can tell you that right now. You do not need that staff. No one wants Jurassic Norms. No one wants Jurassic Norms. Uh, on the upside, at least if you spend literally. Ah, oh, there we go. It's going up slowly. Like even the, they can see if I float with nine people buying food of them. Apparently. Uh, okay. New contract, new contract, new contract, no. Nope, no new contract. Not yet. I don't like this increasing your genome to whatever. It's so hard to do. Okay. Ah, come on. The two minute wait is murder. No, <laughs> the two-minute wait it really is murder. It's absolute murder. There you go. Request a new contract. You. If you can complete this contract, I can see good things okay. in your future. How much guess we? If you fail, I see me in your future. How much guess do we currently have? We want no. What do I check, check that? that? We need as many people as possible to experience these animals for themselves. Realize that dinosaurs are part of our world now. Hmm. So I need to increase my guest count. Clearly. A contract just landed on my desk. Oh, need to take sleeping. a look. Take a photograph of dinosaur sleeping. We can do that. Okay. So how many guests do we have at the moment? There we go. Guest count is 1,200. So. What I'm gonna to do to make people happier to visit this place? So dinosaur visibility at? Uh, dinosaur visibility is currently at 88%. That's pretty good, really. Can't really get better than that. Food is now at 91%. 99% fun rating. 75% shopping. There's one hotel. Shelter protection is great. No, this is absolutely nothing wrong. I'm going to need targets for unique species of dinosaurs. An average dinosaur rating of that. Uh, okay. Welfare, combat infamy, modifications. Okay, I don't know what to do about that one. How much I can do about that one? Well, while we're worried about that one, I guess let's grab a ranger car and go looking for a sleeping dinosaur. Oh, wait, that's not good. Make sure they're fed, for God's sakes. Ah. Spun the camera around by accident. Uh, feed that guy, feed that guy. And feed that guy. Alright. Team 2. Drive! Go, go, go! Far away, Mama said, Por favor, estén conectados. 
Mas só homem, não é certo. Chega a minha sleeping guard, só for God's sakes. Ah, sim, that's all James. Spanish ready in. <laughs> Pretty cool, really. Yay, made eighteen thousand dollars. What a cool photo. Did I sound sincere? Because that's what I was going for. Hey guys, when are you guys just having that? Oh, that's a good idea. What Trank one? Does that work? Okay, it's Trank one. Oh, there. Yes, I counted. Awesome. You have a real eye for composition. Take a shot. We did take the shot. I guess this means congratulations are in order. Without exceptional security, nothing else here would be shots. possible. That's our mandate. And on Islamat and Sierras, you're showing the rest of us how it's done. You're deserving of this reward. Sharper teeth. Because that's what we should definitely generate. Leave generate. some work you might be interested in. Wait, a dinosaur. Okay, so they want me to just incubate a dinosaur. That's doable. You boot that. We can probably get away with another one of these guys right over there. Uh, what's their rating? God damn it. I meant to modify him first to try to make him more impressive before I pushed him out there. Whoops. My bad. God damn it. Oh well. We'll have another duck, please. One more duck, please! <laughs> Sir, that's not a duck, it's a dinosaur. One more duck! <laughs> I'm gonna get rid of that one. I'll get rid of that one. I don't see us doing that one anytime soon. I want to pick up more security contracts. Keep pushing it forward. Ah, oh, what else have we got to unlock from them? We have. No, I don't want to take Don't want one. Ah, uh, skin toughness 2.0, and then security center. That's what we get. Do did we do that? They're not done. How do I? How do I start these missions? I don't know what's next for the little critters, but they are no longer our problem. Which means that contract is complete. Nice job. 
How am I doing though? Um. Ooh, it's, in, it's gotta be in here. Help, reputation. Contracts. Ah, oh, how do you go back to these damn quests? Might have to Google that real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna have to Google that real quick. Because I'm screwed either way there. Um, bringing up reputation quests to accept Jurassic World. It's just going to be something really simple. Like something super simple. Uh, Get a control room, select mission, select security, then select start mission. Okay. That should be fairly straightforward, right? Like, yeah? Okay. So, we go here. We go reputation. We click here. Where is start mission? See it. Summary, more info. Don't see it. Ah! This is so annoying. Um. Okay, I'm gonna go to the fossils. So that we get this going. Meanwhile, well, I ah, I've, I've depleted that. Yeah, I've depleted that. I've depleted that. Animalosaurus is there. Truth of Minus is there. Dracorex is there. Ceratops is there. Okay. Let's get some more media. Okay, so how do I do this? Go to what? In here? Is it? Then? No, 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 they're doing all right. Finance. Ah, missions. Of course, it's right bloody well there. Okay. Glad to have you on board. As you can imagine. Okay. The animals in the various facilities are constantly probing for weaknesses in our security systems. All right. They're so... smarter and more devious than people give them credit for. But I refuse to the underestimate task. their capabilities. That's why I'm always testing and evaluating our security protocols and barriers. And this is where you come in. So let's go knock out this guy. I'm gonna give this guy Lambert his due. He actually sees these animals as both opportunity and threat. What if I do I'm know? gonna need you to extract enough DNA from fossils to incubate and hatch okay. a dinosaur. So no cosmetics this for that. This is the first phase of this mission. Carry on. Okay. Next, you'll need to incubate the animal in a Hammond Creation Laboratory before releasing and housing it in an enclosure. You'll also want to make sure we've got an ACU presence on this island. Alright, let's go with that. And... Very good. Okay. So all we're going to do is sell one of these guys and then make a new one. Made so many of these guys, so this is kind of annoying, but at least it's getting done now anyway. Can't believe it was that easy to start the mission. I knew it would be, I knew it'd be super easy, but I was like, it makes sense. That other box that you never look at, it was the same thing on the um, Xbox, I remember. I was like, how do I pick up those quests again? Just not looking at it. I'm assuming I wouldn't be the only poor bastard not looking at them, but oh well. So we just gotta incubate release one and then we'll hit that and that will give us a storm defense station, which will be really good. Needed for the next area. And so she wants to trike and she gives you cardio strength. Okay, that's pretty cool. I keep hitting back all way too much back. All the back. Uh I gave me nothing to. So it must be part of research, is it? Probably. Because it's not there. Okay, that's fine. No, oh, 59. Here we go. 60, 62, 63, 64. Extract. Extract. 
Let's accept a new contract while we're waiting. Security, thank you. Take the contract. I have a feeling it'll be worth it in the long run. For both of us. So just go release this guy. Very, very good. Very happy with that. Okay. Release. Now we've already seen the duck come out, that's fine. I'm more interested in see whether this actually worked. Okay, so that should complete, right? Can we construct an ACU center? We already have it. ACU reload speed to 0 0.1. Right. This next bit is going to sound a little crazy because, frankly, it is. But we are going to encourage one of the dinosaurs to breach our containment grid. Oh, no. We'll then react and see if our procedures and personnel are up to the challenge. <laughs> yes. So at this point, I'd like to take back everything <laughs> I just said about this guy. <laughs> okay. All right, I'm going to take my own precautions here. And I'm going to look at two of these. And then I'm going to open the gate and I'm going to knock the last one out. Ah! Business no, is good. I don't care. <laughs> I'm about to release meat eaters on the world. Because I, I don't want to run around after a hundred meat eaters. Uh, yeah, it's going to be the really strong one too, so we're not really missing. No, there's a really strong one. Okay, very, very good. Alright. Gates open for you, buddy. Run for safety! Same with the yelling out. This is which one? Cher visiteur, par mesure de précaution et pour votre sécurité, veuillez gagner l'abri le plus proche. Senhoras e senhores, com o pedido de precaução e para sua segurança, prossigam para o abrigo. Fence broken. Fence broken. What do you mean fence broken? Oh, what? Something actually did go down. Oh shit, um, Rangers, come fix this. Things are actually went bad. Ah, ah, he's out. Okay, we have our runner. Time to tag him and bag him. We're using less than lethal, but remember, that dinosaur doesn't know this is just supposed to be a drill. So watch your back. While I understand the need to keep our security as sharp as possible, this is not the way I would go about doing it. Yeah. If you have a problem with how we keep you safe, Doctor, I'm happy to discuss it at a later time. Okay, that guy. Right now, we have our hands right, full. I'm gonna move these guys. Heading to collect the asset. Put them back in there. And you're gonna get eaten. I'm very sorry about this. But it's gonna happen. <laughs> Where's the. Woo. Woo. Scary thing. Oh my god. And now we reach the inevitable life begets death. Oh, but here's died. the question that you gotta ask yourself Was this avoidable? The answer? Of course not. Death, it's always coming. But could you have delayed it? Well, that's maybe another story. 
Okay, so this should fix everything back up now. Everything should be a bit better. I'm just gonna wait a second. Alright. Yes, I can open up the shelters again. Ladies and gentlemen, asset transportation in progress. Go back out, people. It's okay, it's safe. You can venture out. The people of Jurassic Park, you can asset leave your bunkers. Didn't even land asleep, landed awake. And for you, Mr. Escaper, you're going to a new pen. <laughs> it's not going to be a good pen for you. <laughs> nope. It's not going to be a good pen for you at all. <laughs> Goodbye. Water is essential and your dinosaurs require plenty of it. Why are you not providing for their needs? This water there? This water there? It's just so much water. There's a big thing of water in the middle. It's just not in a good place right now. Nope, nope, he is not. Okay, so I need to start the next one before. Something goes horribly wrong. True and square. Okay, but so it's not the issue. thing is, we're still learning where our boundaries are when it comes where to keeping these animals under control. God okay. knows they're working out ways to, to have exploit our weaknesses. Water. Guess we'll find out who gets to the limits of our abilities first. Us or them. Never a you drink? And that's no. always been the challenge of the Jurassic Industrial Complex. Exploitation versus security. The immense potential for profit and for violence. I knew you were my kind of person. Inquisitive. Ah, uh, it's going to take too long to deal with. And I knew you couldn't resist this opportunity. So let's get started. Oh, wait. They don't want to eat Ask it. Receive. It's pretty cool, actually. Together, that they don't want to eat it. We can create a more authentic um, version of our dinosaurs. Let's... That means a complete genome. And I think you are up to the challenge. Don't disappoint. Yeah, you're in a We're bad place, Mr. Duck. So I believe I may be on the cusp of something wonderful. You're in a very bad place, Mr. Duck. At least in part for where I find myself. Now we need to incubate, hatch, and house our dinosaur. Then we will know if our efforts will have been worth it. Okay, I'm going to try to sell you. There you go. Acknowledging asset collection request. You'll probably get eaten way before you get sold because there's so many meat eaters in there. They go, "Oh, look, a sleeping cheeseburger!" But you did choose to break out. This was your choice. I want to take close that try. Ah, uh, oh, I'm not selling. You might get sold before he gets eaten. Before he gets eaten, like the important mention. And do both those, please. That feed And do that feed Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So you want me to produce a triceratops? I'll keep this brief. There's a new contract. Review it. You want me to incubate a Dracorex? So, there's a triceratops. That's a rating of 39. That's actually really good. Yeah, well, whatever that cosmetic is, the crowd will love it. 49. 51. 53. Okay. We'll have all these random genomes in you. Okay, and you guys want a Draco Rex. Alright. Do a Draco Rex as well. Same time.
So I guess I want to make more money. Probably. No, did I get any research? No. What's this one doing for me? Nothing. Okay, cool, cool, cool. No, I need more money. Restaurant. How well are you doing now? Oof, not very well. No one wants trashy nom. Maybe steak? What's that for? Like 45 bucks. A steak meal. How's that gonna go? Is that gonna go down well with you guys? You guys want steak? getting better. People want steak. What can I say? You did good. Uh, if I don't release this, it shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so I just got the next reward for that one. So how many am I off with this one? Just one more security center. Done. Cool, 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 cool. Very good. I'm very happy with that. And then we're nearly done with the first island. Oh my god, nearly done with the first island. Trike! I think we get a Rex on the next island. Ah, oh, can't wait. Or is it Raptors? One of the two. Is Rex or Raptors? Or both. Both would be better. Can't really remember. Oh crap, we have a sleeping guy that we need to get rid of over here, I think. Oh no, oh, oh no. Our new specimens, sorry, dinosaurs, are meeting expectations. But we want them to thrive. That's your next assignment. Making sure our specimens are properly cared for. In other words, dinosaur welfare. The difference with dinosaurs is that they have no point of reference to understand humans, so don't expect much in the way of thank yous. Okay. Well, they're like 98% English. I've been monitoring what you've been up to with great interest, and I'm a little disappointed okay. that Dr. Dua came to you for this assignment instead of bringing me into the loop as she should have done. I'll discuss this with her later. Is that number two? Right, we'll sell number two. Transit has commenced. Oh, we'll, we'll knock out another one. We'll sell that one. Whew. Okay, so selling steak kind of worked out. We're now earning a lot more money. Guest count's still fairly low. Sorry, Trike, you're going to the butcher. Goodbye, Trike. We're selling you for the, for the meat shop. Uh, okay, so. Go sell them. Very well. Goodbye, trike. Goodbye. Yeah, I don't have 70 cent genome though, so that was kind of annoying. Ah, oh, I'm making a lot of money. $19. Oh, we can actually put more stuff on here. Ladies and gentlemen, we are pleased to welcome the Sunshine You there, deal with that. Setting additional task. Oh, that's part of this quest, okay. Well, we've already done that a hundred times now. <laughs> like 120 times now. Okay, so this gift shop is doing... Better. Or worse. Yeah, around about better. This restaurant is doing... Way worse. Giganto steaks for $45 for a pair of How much that cost me? 20 So we'll sell them for, what, 35 
try to make a profit from here. Uh, what's the, how's this fast food restaurant doing? Doing all right. Wow. No diseased dinosaur is detected. We'll sell that then. Twenty-two. Should boost the income a bit. That's that mission. Well done! Hey, Bootin! I haven't seen you all year. How are you, my friend? Sorry, I didn't see you come on because I was um, <laughs> micromanaging money. <laughs> this will definitely shift the paradigm. I can't ignore this accomplishment. Oh, with your help, obviously. That goes yeah, I only saying. just got but back into the swing of um, swing not long ago, team. so it's actually Let's good to see again. you back on like my I'll second day. I've witnessed Dr. Doom flail and failed okay. before. We're nearly done with this island. Now with you, she believes she's on her way. I, the island's getting Does old. Does she really think she can accomplish Oh, what we need I this thought. last one here. This is what we need. Security Center. Hmm. Security Center needs to go up to there. So we need another security contract. Ah, uh, do, 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 do. where are we? Add new, add new, security contract, done. What do, what do you want us to do? For ways to oh, guest count. Here. God and damn I it. Think this new contract I already have one that does the exact thing. same one. Getting more visitors. And... People are afraid okay. of what they don't understand. But these islands okay, and I'm the dinosaurs to worry that about inhabit this. them um, can change that fear to something else. Oh, that's Maybe. annoying. I don't know. But the key is to get as many folks here as you can. Wow, those diamond dishes are coming in pretty expensive, like, like 20 bucks. Like, nearly double the, the price and they're earning me crazy amounts of money. What was this? Is this a clothes shop? They're selling really expensive shirts, are they? Yeah, they are. Um, I might just drop that down to cost a bit more. 18. Might up my customer count. Yeah, I was going to get below zero. I really was. So, do you think it's worth it? Like, I was looking at below zero going, oh, $27. I know I'm going to want to play it. I know I'm going to want to play it. Astro Nier looks actually really good. I got it on Xbox, and I was like, mm. But it was only really early then, and people seemed like it, a whole heap seemed done with it since then, though. So, I guess I should probably be happy with that. I've been good, man. I've been good. I had a busy start of the year. Like, the whole first month was well crazy. December was well crazy. Things are evening out and coming a bit more relaxing, which is great. I've been playing lots of 4X games lately because, you know, how easy they are to pause and leave. Not as much shooters. Oh, I played Kingdom Hearts 3. That was an experience. That was awesome. <laughs> yeah, but I get that you're biased because I love it too. And you know what? It actually, um, Subnautica won like a shitload of awards last year. You would have been really happy with that. It won like a ton of rewards. I don't remember which ones, but I do remember it was a ton. I was remember looking it up going, good on you, Subnautica. It was like, you know, like it beat Ark out for like the best, um, the best survival game. It... Sun of Skies, yeah, um, I'm actually really amped for something else, you're gonna hate me, I'm really really amped, like I even put in my pre-order today for um, Generation Zero, and I was like, it looks really good, god damn it, Generation Zero looks really really good. I thought the game lineup this year was pretty terrible, and then the more I look, the happier I am with everything that's coming out. I was going to get Sunless Guys too, though. I really was. Oh, are we there yet? So all this guest count stuff. You know what? I'm going to dump one of these, like that one. No, I might dump that one. I'll turn that out. After a new contract, see if there's something easier. We can always solve a few more problems. Okay, quite so a sure that, you know, Generation contract. Zero, yeah, it's uh, releases end of March. Look, 
And um, I know they're looking for ways to control the dinosaurs in the security division. And it's going to be PC. This new genome helps with that. But instead of control, with these I would love to bait our key for it, but unfortunately it didn't quite get in. Oh, uh, Anthem street. as well is literally a couple of weeks away, which I did chuck a pre-order in for, because I played the demo, and I didn't have all the problems that everyone said they had. You know how everyone's like, oh, I've, this was like shittest game ever, blah, blah, blah. And it didn't, I didn't have those problems. Like, I had an infinite load screen once, and I felt... Like, I must have just missed all over everyone having all these problems somehow, but I was like, yeah. Um, Generation Zero is an open world survival game produced by, I don't really know if it's like a, an indie company or not, but it got on my radar last year and you're combating, like, you go on a hunting or like a, like a trip with your friends and you come back to the shore in Sweden. Now, it's a huge map of Sweden, big open world map of Sweden. So you come back onto the shores of Sweden, and um, suddenly the world is like, it's empty, there's no one there, and the only thing left is robots. Tons of these hostile, murderous robots. Now, what's really drawing it to me is the aspect of that is persistent. So, you blow an arm piece off a robot, but then you have to run because they turn and beat the crap out of you then that same patrol robots will be around later and that guy that you blew the chest piece off will be still wandering around and it's what really draws it to me is the persistent world that's so big so it will actually feel like you're knee deep into affecting a world I'm not sure if it has base building mechanics because this is a survival game but I assume that you'll be taking over like an abandoned house and working from it because you, you can't not right like literally you can't not Let's not argue over the small stuff. Looking at the big picture, this is a solid contract. But it looks real. It looks super good. I'm actually really looking forward to Generation Zero. Yeah, it does. Right? Sounds really good. It's um end of March. Solaris console edition as who releases around about the same time as Anthem. Um, I did a pre-order for Anthem Legion of Dawn edition. So I'm going to be playing that on Xbox. But I will be working my streaming setup with the Xbox for that and actually playing it through. I was really going I was going to do Kingdom Hearts um, because I really enjoyed it. But at the same time, it was nice to have an offline game and something to play while life was a bit hectic. So, I really did enjoy just having that to myself. So, yeah. um, did you actually have a go at Kingdom Hearts 3 when it came out? Like, it, I didn't, I honestly didn't think Kingdom Hearts would be my game. But it surprised the crap out of me. It was a really good game. Oh, I really need this last bloody security objective so I can move islands. I'm kind of sick of being here in this island now. And you can make up the, the five star later. Like, it's not a big deal. You just pump out a Rex with all the bloody ratings later on. But right now, you're just going to work on it until you can get there. It's like so annoying. Let's turn that contract. Try for another one here in a minute. Yeah, so I dumped a pre-order on Anthem, Legion of Dawn, I dumped a pre-order on Generation Zero, and I dumped a pre-order onto Solaris the Console Edition. Because, who doesn't want Solaris on console as well as on PC? Because it's a great game! I actually have to do some Solaris on here. I get prepared for like 100 hours, I guess, right? Oh, I played some Divinity 2 with a friend as well. I'm debating whether I should buy Divinity 2 on PC and just play it on PC. Like... Oh, mate. Kingdom Hearts. Yeah. Like, it's worth a look. Even if you don't like the genre, it's worth looking.
because it was a very surprising game because we've all watched like Disney movies and that lots of Path of Exile yeah I almost well, grabbed Path of Exile I present the contracts, um, you complete them, everybody wins. So I was, how about we rack up another win, huh? I was playing the crap out of Diablo on the Switch, because I bought a Switch for myself then the last just year. Reports of a new Don't regret it. I got a Diablo Switch, Looks so I've been like playing Diablo on it. Handle. And then I've been thinking, oh, what else can I play that's a bit like you know, Diablo 3? And then the first thing that came to my mind was Path of Exile, of course. <laughs> I'll have to grab Astroneer though. Um, last time I tried it, I tried it on Xbox, so I'm assuming it's a lot better on PC, right? It's gotta be heaps better on PC. And I definitely do want to grab Subnautica below zero. I do have a question though. Is it buggy? Or should I, like, if I wait, will it be better? No diseased dinosaurs. Is um blow zero buggy, or is it like perfectly smooth? Doesn't error up that much, or at least to some point playable. You know what I mean? <laughs> like not frustratingly bad, not like arc bad or Atlas bad. Atlas was so bad. Oh my god, I was so let down by Atlas. This game is so pretty. It's hard not to be in love with dinosaurs. I'll, dinosaurs are definitely my thing. I love Jurassic Park. Damn straight. Okay, I'm definitely going to pick that up. Not this week, because I've got to go camping with the missus in the weekend. Um, so I want a nice big run at it. I'll have to do some Below Zero then, right? I watched the trailer. It looks so good. Oh my god. I was like, oh my god, they dropped this? It just... They just dropped this? Very excited about that one, I saw it. But because of the time investment, I've been holding off grabbing it. But then I, I think I just spent like 60 hours or something on Kingdom Hearts, so I should be good. <laughs> I should definitely be good. Come on, security contract. Why are you going to be so goddamn annoying? Uh, profit per minute has to be 300. Okay, so I need somewhere to sell something for a ridiculous price and make money from it. Oh, what are you selling? You're not making any money for these sino chefs. They're like, I was hoping to get more people in. I'm going to pump it down just a notch so that it makes a bit more money. Oh yeah, the wife played um, Kingdom Hearts as well. She loved it. It was great. We don't even know the characters, seriously. We, like, we had no idea what the game was about. There's this quick little eight or nine chapter thing when you go to play it that you can watch all these movies, but literally they won't have any lasting effect of your memory. <laughs> I really want to build Ultima Weapon on Kingdom Hearts now, but my problem is um, it's got a ton of mini games I've got to play and then other really annoying stuff before I can actually do anything about it. Uh, 
I guess let's send that on a dig team. Should be able to get to the 7,500 profit from these things. Why isn't that happening? Screw it. I'll just make them really expensive. And that's what I did before. Like, I overcharged the crap out of all this stuff. It was bringing me a massive profit. I'm like, you know what? I'll worry about what people think. And I went in and, like, seriously, Dinobytes is a $2 expense. Selling for $20 it gives me $1,000. <laughs> How's that even fair? So they're selling that for 18. Let's pump that up to 26. Done. Gift shop. What's it selling? $10 for $19. Done. Okay. What are you selling? Dino dish. $16. I'm gonna make it 20 two dollars. Clothing shop, selling t-shirts for 18. I don't like t-shirts. Let's sell hats for 18. Same, same price, same, same everything. Let's just make it happen. Okay. It's really good to see you, Bhutan. So I'm hoping you've really enjoyed your break as well, over this time. That's a job. Oh, would you look at that? You just overcharge for everything, and then similarly, it just goes boom. I don't even care what people are spending. Just, just overcharge, and you just straight away get it. Okay, so if I go in here, I go contracts. We'll take another security contract. This latest contract is a little okay. unexpected. That's actually really but I'm doable. I'm sure you'll rise to the challenge. So we're gonna get storm defense. That's really, really, really doable. Um, not enclosures, not maintenance. Oh, operations, storm defense. Okay. Need to get the sixty percent. Uh, what's rotating? In? Z. It's been okay. Everything been going alright then? Or are you just like, ah, it's fine. <laughs> Nobody died, so it's all good. <laughs> extract, extract, sell, sell. Go dig. Here. Okay, Whew. all I really, my main goal for this little run was to just at least get off the salmon. Same shit, different day. Congratulations are in order. You uh, ace that weather coverage contract. My friends are all sort of moving this year. So, <laughs> hey, done. Okay, security, done. Oh my god, we can finally leave this island when we feel like it. What I might do is I might change games real quick. <laughs> So, um, what I will do really fast is I'll be right back and I'm just going to swap them over and then I literally will come straight back. I'll probably play some civilization or something casual, but yeah, the security let's, let's get off this planet. <laughs> let's get off this island before it like literally gets worse because I've been on this island now for like four hours. So not that that's a bad thing, but whew, sick of this island. So I'll, I'll probably give it another game a go and I'll be right back. Okay, see you soon.
Welcome back. We'll try something new that I started, that I actually bought not long ago. Um, Frostpunk. If you're still there, Butan, it's good to see you again, my friend. Yeah, no, I um, I actually bought this last year when it was on special, and it's another game that was pulling so many rewards, uh, awards at the end of the year that it was just really worth it. Whew. Such a good scenario, good scenario. Ah, oh, there is lots of new scenarios. It's the new, okay. What is the arts? Price one. Cool. Okay, there's a heap of new ones to play. I will play a new home though, because I wanted to try the first one again. See how it did. Now, last time religion went really, really strong for me, like super strong. I was burning people at the stake with religion. It was like really powerful <laughs> to have religion going. So, yeah, it, it was good. It was really, really good. So we'll just load up uh, Frostpunk. Now, if you haven't heard of Frostpunk, it is a survival slash steampunk simulated game where you run a, the last society of human race and try to make them basically live out their days as the world ices over and everyone's huddled around a giant coal burning generator for warmth <laughs> It's actually won a fair few rewards last year, and it well deserved, like well deserved rewards. Hunters check their traps during the night, bringing back food for the morning. Ah, so that's why they work at night time. We roam the still, cold world. No horizon in sight. The rulers of old. Stripped of pride and glory. It feels as yesterday we were turning the wheels of progress. Until the frost stopped it all. Suddenly, without a warning. When tides had changed, they changed for all of us. No matter wealth or class. We've lost our world to snow. And with it, our last traces of humanity. I really thoroughly enjoy playing this, so it's going to be good to have another go. We bid farewell to plenty. For those who remained, came the time to adapt. We decided to leave our homes and head north. We roamed for weeks, maybe months, leaving behind all the things we once believed had made us. It was hope that pushed us forward. Slowly, step by step, we knew the cost of our journey, and we paid the price a hundred times. Finally, the time has come to build the last city on Earth. Are you right? <laughs> um, I just started Frostpunk in its very epic intro. <laughs> it has a great intro, like super great intro. Have you given this a go yet? It's was I got I picked it up for like thirty bucks. It's so good. I turned into a, like a religious punk. Yeah, yeah. All the updates were. I just looked at them then. I can't wait to start them. But I was like, yeah, no, I'll go in and I'll start this first. Book of Laws, what, what should we go with? I usually like going this way, uh, but I'm going to go super. New new How good is it though? Like, it is so damn good. I was really pleasantly surprised with this game. I can't remember what I'm looking at anymore though, so I need 80 houses. That's fine, let's build 80 houses. Okay. 
1982. Harvest over here. So we'll set up, what, 10 people for that. Put the kids there, you go to our labor first. <laughs> I never go child labor because <laughs> it just makes everyone so happy if you ever go child labor because the hope was like the killing mechanic for me. <laughs> That's so awesome. <laughs> Does it work out for you? <laughs> uh, what have we got? We got ten more workers available. So coal! You need me coal. Actually, no, I won't harvest that coal. Where's the good coal? That's the good coal pile. I'll harvest this coal pile. Max, max, done. Harvest me helping. So if I remember correctly, there's actually a time button in this one. Where's the time button? Them kids to work. That's so awesome. <laughs> All the free updates look really good though, but then you have You've got low zero, so why would you, like, why wouldn't you, right? Like, be playing the crap out of low zero. Uh, oh, I haven't turned this on yet. Whoops, my bad. I forgot that you gotta turn the actual generator on when you first get here. That's very bad of me. Get the heat up. Is that wood? Yeah, that's wood. Wooden crates. I ended up being like a religious fanatical leader last time. And it worked out so well for me. I was like burning people on the generator and I, I made myself like the word of the mouth of God and Oh, the hope thing disappeared, like you became immune to hope, like it, it didn't hurt you anymore, so you only had to worry about discontent, it was like so strong, it makes me almost want to go religion every time because of how strong it was, but I haven't gone military yet, and I'm kind of hoping military does the same thing, because it wouldn't be, like, it'd be really unfair if military didn't, because then there'd be no real reason to go military, ever. Put sawdust in their soup. <laughs> Did you go, um, do you go corpse disposal or cemeteries? I, I kind of like the ice pits that you dump corpses into. <laughs> I really do. And then you can, like, eventually go and use them for body parts to heal the sick and wounded. <laughs> So morbid, but so so entertaining all at the same time. I better build a gathering post, actually. Ugh, oh, I'm so out of practice for this game. Uh, I need lots of wood now. Yeah, the cemeteries went over a lot smoother, but um, amputations became a big deal for me but like I said when you lose the hope mechanic if you go the religious nut faith and you lose the hope mechanic it actually works out really strong So out of practice, I'm gonna lose this one terribly. I can already tell. Well, my phone is dying. I will be right back as I go and grab a charger. <laughs>
And we are back. Sorry about that. Just realised that, whoa, wait, I'm not going to have a thing soon. Yeah, I figured a quick game of um, Frostpunk would go down well. So many games last year, so many games this year that have just snuck around. Things that I, like, I was like, the gaming lineup looks terrible, and then everything I wanted sort of dropped at the start of the year, which was great, like, Blow Zero dropped, freaking, um, Generation Zero dropped. Uh, literally everything dropped, it was so good. <laughs> well, don't be, I'm going to go down so hard, because I even forgot about using the bloody <laughs> gathering posts. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to like fix everything now really fast but it's nearly daytime so if we go here we go max I should turn that back around oh I screwed everything up already I feel really bad I've lost out on a whole day's work <laughs> this game looks graphically amazing though. but I've never seen a prettier survival game although Anno is coming out this year That's right, it needs a road too, so I better build a road. Do I have a road? Where is it? Roads? Uh, that one. Nope, I don't have enough. God damn it! Not good! Done everything wrong already. Yeah, yeah. Everything goes down so fast. Um, I'm just gonna have to go max on the wood until the morning. Uh, where is speed up? Do we just hit like plus? Pause, pause, yeah, that's it. Oh, it's up here. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, so we have new lore. Let's go with. Oh, you like child labor. Child shelters does what though? Raises hope, doesn't it? Hope will rise. Yeah, it raises hope. Hope kills me every time I play this. Yeah, yeah, exactly. And, oh, I love getting the machines up and going, but then they start stepping on people, and it's like, oh my god, it stepped on everybody. I might um, go with emergency shifts, because I normally don't go with emergency hear shifts. Me, me. So if I do that now... Yeah, I'm gonna go with emergency shifts, I feel. What the hell? Don't pause. I never go with emergency shifts early, so I'm gonna go with emergency shifts and see if I actually like it. Okay, there's the morning. Oh, it's that sun crawl around. Alright, so we're working on it. Do we have any wood yet? Literally, they start harvesting wood straight away. Okay, I only needed eight wood to get to the town. There we go, eight wood, done. Alright, so that should produce that, and now I should be able to go down here. Uh, none. I always scatter like crazy, because I wanted to always get as much of those steampunk machines up and going. Ah, the generator's down! The shift is ending. What the hell? Oh my god, the day was like, so fast. Um... Let's do this. And then if we go here, we go what? Max. No, they're gonna build overnight. Okay. Generator turned off. That's not good. Do we have any coal? Yeah, we have coal. Why is the generator off? They actually built that overnight. That's great. So we'll start with that and that. And if we can just chuck another gathering post near this coal here. Oh. Just do that. Yeah, okay. 
Another day, another shift. Yep, it is. Alright, I'm gonna put it a bit faster anyway. Speed it up so we have a bit more consequences. So what do you want? Resource shortage. We're getting short resources and these are growing by the hour. Stain workshop. We can already do that, can't we? Listen, everyone. New law is signed. So, if we go here and we go extend, that should give us a bit more coal. Yeah, I know, right? I'm. Um. I don't know if you have to run it only at night, because it does raise hope a little bit as well, and. It, as long as it's heating, it stops injury. So my problem is, I, I don't have any hospitals yet, so I don't want any healing things yet, either. Yeah, see, so I already got sick. Thought that might happen, because I had no healing there for a little bit. Uh, we're gonna need a medical post, like, soon. Alright. If I get the generators up and going as quickly as I can though, that should fix that anyway is my problem. So, medical post. Fight the cold! Uh, yep, food is now going to become a problem. We're going to need... Hunter's lodges and cook houses. Ah! Oh, I'm so far behind already. Okay. Houses. Come on, medical post. Come on, come on. Twenty five wood. We can do it. We can do it. Why is like no one there? Are they all sick or something? say. Max please. Max is one? No. None then. Max. People from my convoy. Basic resources. Yeah, build a beacon. Of course, let's build a beacon. Engineers. Uh, I'm going to turn that on to soup. Turn that on to six. You're going to start looking for food, you're going to start cooking food. Uh, I need to get that medical bay up, like, now. <laughs> Alright, there you go, start healing people. I'll build a little generator there for heat later on. Because I just realised I should have built that, like, right up against the side, but I didn't. Um, so three people are gravely sick. I'll use engineers to man this. Okay, so Book of Laws comes around soon. I'm going to build kid shelters, because kid shelters lead to lots of engineers, because you use the kid shelters to train engineers. I like engineers. You can use them to like go and harvest random stuff too if you want to, so it's not that bad to go with the engineers. Uh, child shelters, there we go. Build one of them. New law! New law! New law for our people! Uh, so what's that? We need, what, 20 wood, 5 steel. Whew. Maybe we should extend the shift at the, like, here. We can't extend that shift, so we will. Child shelter, there we go. Build one of those. They're hunting, that's good. Are we out of food? No, we just gotta turn it into food, which will be fine. Uh, are we making enough? No, extend it. Screw it. You all work harder! I never I didn't I've never played this mode before. Like I've never had all this extended work shift stuff going on, so this should be interesting. Never done it before. Um is that literally not in range of anything now? That is literally not in range of anything. Hit none. And I guess let's dismantle. Let's tear it down. Um, 
crap. I'm gonna need like a sawmill soon or something. Let's see what's these. Are these cold piles? Yeah, these are cold piles. Okay, max. Uh, yeah, okay, we'll end it for the day. Someone died, I think. <laughs> Make them sawdust soup. Yeah, I love sawdust soup. First death, yeah, we had someone die. Okay, open the book of laws. Consider making a cemetery. I can't make a cemetery though, because I can't sign it right now. Let's just eat him. He's meat, right? We can eat the guy that died from the extended work shifts. Ah! My lady ship's so dead. So bad. What? Ah oh, no, we dropped out to 37 degrees. Okay, okay, okay. So we've got plenty of food. We're, t we're turning it into actual food. Uh, I feel our workstation, our medical station might be overrun. It's too cold. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> okay, we're going to need a medical station, which is fine, because we need more ones anyway. And we'll just build it right down here. Okay. Children cared for. Okay, so we need to make sure the children are cared for. Can we build the shelter? Yeah, we built the shelter. Uh, we don't have heaters yet, do we? Yeah, we don't have heaters yet. Alright, I'm just going to hit none on that. And we'll, we'll go with this. How do we get heaters? Oh, we need a beacon, that's right. To research stuff. Oh, workshop, sorry. 15 wood. Is there any wood left there? Yeah, there's wood left there. Wow. I managed to get this way ahead of myself. Okay. How are people hungry when the soup kitchen has been serving them all food? Like, there is food there. Go and eat it. What the hell, guys? Yeah, I know, right. Um, it, it ends up feeling really cluttered, but I guess when you're, like, trying to save the human race from the ground up, that's a feeling that I guess you do get. Like, medieval towns do end up looking really cluttered as well and that. Is that the beacon? Is the workshop the beacon? Where's the beacon at? Oh no, you gotta research the beacon, that's right. Okay, cool. Whew, we've got so much coal now anyway, so we're good, because we've been harvesting the crap out of it. Um, apparently there's a way to dig out the walls to make the place bigger as well. But my place never needed that. Um, my problem was I had tents like literally the whole game. And so when it came to building decent living, that people wouldn't freeze to death in. I, I suffered trying to make that happen. It was really painful. Ah, oh, why isn't the soup getting produced? Yay! Hope bros. <laughs> okay, so workshop. We'll take some engineers there. Good, good, good. Let's do heaters, maybe? I need heaters right now. I'm gonna do heaters. So, can I build the beacon now? Or do I have to research it? I have to research it. Okay, that's right. That's fine. I can't believe I'm already on the heaters. Oh, so much pain in this game. Um, I don't need this right now. I'm just going to spend out of wood. I'm going to need, like, this down here. Is that, is that in that? I feel that should be in that. That is in that. Okay. There's nothing there. There's only those there. And then mines. So I pretty much worked through all my resources. I, I will need this stuff down here though. So I guess we'll go to... Uh, gathering po 
post. Check the gallery post there. Connect it up. Oh, I hope this temperature drops soon. I really need it to drop. Oh, my kitchen's so far away. God damn it. And he just ain't gonna research forever. Oh, poor planning. So much poor planning. <laughs> oh, I hadn't played in so long. <laughs> Do I have a steam call though? Where did I get a steam call from? Okay, and now... So she wanted cemeteries. I, I, I don't want my hope and my discontent to rise more. So I'll go with cemeteries. Family torn apart, woman looking for her, yes I know. Yeah, I'm so behind the curve. By then, I'm usually looking for where to go for that one. God damn it. So behind. Come on, temperature, drop a little bit. I can get a break. Um, cemetery. Uh, cemeteries don't need to be heated, so we just dump it right down the end there. Workshop looks pretty sweet. These guys did so much work with this game. It's very impressive. The street lamp, that looks cool. Alright, so this is up. Let's make sure we don't run out of coal while we're backpedaling and trying to make this all work. Ugh. Okay, research. Yeah, I know research is working. We've got research going. I have to play the new scenarios once I actually get the hang of this again. <laughs> Cemetery established. Hope rises. Yay! So we need to build a beacon and rescue the lost expedition, which brings more people in, which means we're going to need more food, which means I'm going to need heating here, which means speed up. Just speed the hell up. One of these two things needs to happen. Okay, now there's hungry people again. Now there's sick people again. Because there's hungry people, there's sick people. God damn it. Are eating raw food. So they're eating raw food and they're getting sick. Ah. Wait, can I just. Yeah, I can extend this. Go! I took the extended shifts to actually give it a go and see whether it's worth it. So I figured I was going to go so badly this run anyway, I might as well just check extended shifts and see whether it's worth doing. Uh, so far I've worked one guy to death. One guy isn't too bad. Let him rest. Get back to work. Let him rest. We'll be nice. We'll be generous. This content's rising like crazy. I'm going to need a fighting pit at this rate. Time to get to work. Need the Tyler Durden style fighting pit, like ASAP. Don't have the research for that yet, though. Or the law. I'm gonna have to pass it with the next bill. Yeah, there we go. Now I can put heating on there. Which gets the food kitchen going again. Uh, I need the beacon. Where the hell is the beacon? Beacon. Behind the curve is terrible. Absolutely terrible. Uh, ha, 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 ha. 
Do some producing food again. I need my hunters to be hunting, that's what I need. So, are you so cold? Yeah, you're so cold. But I don't need you guys operating. So, hold operations. Off. Yeah, on. Okay. So, I'm gonna need another hunting one for sure, because this is the way this is going. I'm gonna have to build it now and just start stockpiling food. Same. Okay, wood's gonna be a problem. Oh no, wood's gonna be a problem. Ah! Oh, we're gonna need new law here in a minute. Is that wood there? Are we getting wood from this or not? We are getting wood from this. Okay, so we're in new law. Uh, fighting arenas. Let's go! Ding, 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 ding. Hear me, hear me! New law in the city! Fighting arenas. Every night the fight will be organised here, lowering discontent. Sounds great. <laughs> they punch each other instead of like complaining about me as the leader. It's how, it's how true leadership deals with things. Okay, it's hard to do this because... Beacon research. Thank God for that. Um, ooh, what do I want? Okay, I need to keep researching something. Faster gathering. Let's do. No, there's no wood. Oh dear. Yep, I have a very limited crap timeline. So, again, back to trying extended work shifts. Let's go, guys. Work overnight. Oh god, look at that discontent, right? <laughs> Boof! <laughs> that discontent just went straight up. That was horrible. Oh dear. Where's my beacon? Uh, tech. Beacon. Require me 20 wood. Alright. I put, a, I put a heater on over there now too. <laughs> I haven't actually played this way before. This is a very aggressive way of playing. Normally I'm like slow and low key, but I'm trying to like thump it out because I figured I'm not going to go well. So, like, let's let's just try it. Okay, so I'm gonna need 20 wood. Go, 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 go. Work some more people to death. 12 wood. Steel wreckage depleted. Maybe they'll work more on what I want them to work on now. Ah, oh, that hunter's hut has no one in it. Send some people off to start doing that. Oh, the hunt, the, yeah, 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 the... fighting arena. Yeah, it's building over here. So, build a fighting arena right there. It is building though. There we go. Fighting arena established. Done. Okay, cool. Yeah, I really, I wanted to build the fighting arena straight away anyway to help lower that discontent from me overworking everybody like crazy. Um, I'm just going to build a beacon real quick. I'm overworking everyone now. I'm going to kill somebody else. Oof, micromanagement is not my friend today. Uh, what's going on here? Research goal not set. Okay. So I only need, what, 10 wood to research faster gathering. We want a coal thumper, actually. So that cost me 15 wood. Done. We're going to go with the coal thumper. Or maybe a sawmill? Because it looks like wood's going to be a problem in the very near future. Sawmill. 10. Do sawmill. We'll try to get all those out there. I feel 
I should stop this before someone dies. He can build. We're no longer a boss in mind. Okay. Oh, cutscene! Yeah, I did all the things. Yeah, I... I do. I do. I really need a cold thumper. I really need... Oh my god. This is so painful. Beacon! Beacon! Literally, like, it's just a big light on a balloon. <laughs> Okay, lost expedition. I gotta I need to form a party first. Uh, where do I need? Is that 40 wood? Is that 40 wood? Do I need 40 wood? Oh my god, I need 40 wood. And five people. Well then. So, there's even 40 wood left there. There's 64 wood left there. I don't remember this being this hard last time. Uh, okay, so I'm gonna need to research that sawmill like really soon. What do you want? Food for overtime work. Yes, they deserve it. Food's not my problem at the moment. <laughs> They work at night, they get more food. Eat! Eat! You look so skinny! Is there wood there as well? Is that, that's wood too, right? Oh, there's only six left in that one. This is not good. Might just spend it on a sawmill first to guarantee more wood. Because if we don't have wood, I can't build anything. Yeah. The constant stress of everybody's gonna go damn die. <laughs> so wonder I won on so many awards. It's so good. Beautiful game too. Okay, we have the beacon now anyway. Um, I've lost some of the loot crates. This is so bad. I can't overtime them. Did it just get colder? No, we've got less cold. Thank God for that. So I can turn that heater off, I think, because I think it's optimal now. I have no engineers available either now. Jesus Christ. Okay, come on. Move. Time to get to work. Okay, so that's done. We'll go to here. I'm gonna need coal thumper. So we'll build the sawmill. Yeah, okay, so we built the sawmill. We have enough left for a beacon, so if I go off of that, hit none, off, um, and I take one guy out of there, we go here, I go plus, okay, cool, now we have a search team. Now, the Lost Expedition that way, Crash Tides that way. We'll go Lost Expedition, because we want to. God damn it. Why is this hard to click at the moment? Go. Go! No, I really need to get Ash in here. Is it multiplayer? I don't even know if it's multiplayer. I played it on Xbox in a little tiny bit. But um, when I played it on Xbox, it wasn't the best on Xbox. So I feel it's going to be a lot better on PC though, because it's one of those games where pointing and clicking really bloody matters.
Oh, interesting. Drop in, drop out, or like server run? I was like, literally this close to starting a Minecraft server today. Because <laughs> I wanted to play something first person. Work day ends. It's time off. Keep gathering wood. Do not stop. Snow, Kyra of excited voices welcome us. Thank God you found us! We have been wondering for days until we couldn't go any longer. Soon we'll begin to starve. Children and adults surround us, packed and ready to go. Escort the survivors back home. Drop in, drop out's really good though. Like, all games should probably just start as drop and drop out anyway. So, really, no problem with that at all. Something I kind of wanted to get my hands on and didn't get around to it was, um... What do you call it? Uh, what was it called again? No Man's Sky. I really wanted to get my hands on No Man's Sky. But I really couldn't justify I did get Monster Hunter though. And Monster Hunter was actually quite good. Ended up picking up the deluxe copy of Monster Hunter on the Xbox? Yeah, Xbox. Because anything I pick up on the Xbox when I buy it on the Xbox, I count share with Sarah, my wife. So Literally, we're sharing gold, we're sharing games, so anything I buy digitally on the Xbox, we can share and play. So she got to play Kingdom Hearts for one copy that I, we bought together, which was really good. Saves money, saves time, it's just all good. Nothing wrong with it at all. Except the fact it's on an Xbox. <laughs> Scouts have returned. Now let me guess, you all need housing? We're here! We bring plague and pestilence! It's heartwarming reunion, family hardships, we shouldn't be there, there's settlements nearby. The first expedition left London long ago, they ought to be well established by now. They'll surely help us find our footy. Oh, how long have I had a law for? Um, medical purposes, engineer purposes. Okay, so, so for the others is here now. Um, people. So I need housing. How much housing do I need? 35. Each one of these guys got 10. Yeah, 10. for everybody. Um, uh, go to the trash site. Go, 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 go. Ok, 
Okay, so I've got wood coming in. Researching coal thumpers. Then I need to research steel mills, which are in the walls. Yeah, I'll, um, I'll go check um, Astroneer out when I'm done for the day today. I probably won't be long in. I think I'll have one run at this, and then I'll have a bit of a break and have something to eat for lunch and stuff. And then I might have a look at Astroneer at the same time. I've got a lot of games. <laughs> like, literally, it's two weeks till Anthem as well, which I really want to drop a bit of time into. Soon it was like a $120 title on the Xbox, so very expensive for the Legion Dawn Edition. And I know it's just going to be your regular, let's get gear and shoot things, but it's going to be great fun still, because, um, who doesn't want to be Iron Man, literally? Oh, Jesus Christ, we're running out of, uh, we're going to need a resource post. Oh, Xbox and Steam are doing crossplay. Wow, that's a big deal. That's a really big deal. Because they, they reckon they, they would never do that because of the whole um, thing about ARC. So, I bet you a lot of ARC players are like, no, why wouldn't you do crossplay with ARC? I'm kind of actually interested to see what if they eventually bring out Atlas as well. <laughs> Fate of the Forgotten. There are plenty of priceless supplies in the wreckage of the, our expedition. Searching among crates scattered in the snow behind the wrecks, we found bodies. They are tangled together and in a single frozen mass, as if the people were trying to find the last bit of warmth before they just died. We do nothing for them, not even bury them. But we take your stuff. Ours now. Go for the observatory. Yeah, I'll definitely um go have a look at Ashwini when I take a break here. I think that'd be great. Oh, uh, where is daylight? To deal with that. Why did everybody just disappear into the mountains? <laughs> Over time. time <laughs> go 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 wow I've got so many people available now call thumpers work again? I've actually forgotten how they work. Uh, coal thumper. By pumping pressure into the ground, coal, 
underneath coal deposits. Coal hunter are a precious resource to the surface for me enough for two gathering posts. So one call thumper does two gathering posts. Cool. Alright, so we have a gathering post there and a gathering post there. If I put it roughly in the middle, it should probably be in the way of both of them. Oh, out of range of that one. And out of range of that one. No, yeah, yeah, no, yeah, definitely out of range of that one. God damn it. Failed both. Alright, we'll just build another gathering post, probably. Yeah, we'll just build another gathering post. Work time. Get back to work. Explore. Some is dimming. Hit astronauts, met by people. One of them, they wrote up in their diaries, blown sunlight, something lit. Shared by southern volcanoes, the sun is dimming. Oh, I didn't know you actually found people alive there. Usually they're dead, aren't they? At the observatory. Pretty sure they're usually dead. Oh well, they're alive. That's all that matters. They're alive! Well, we're gonna need it soon. Uh, faster gathering. Let's go. No, can't do that one. Ah, I need wood. I need crazy amounts more wood. Okay, so I guess we'll spend a bit of wood on another wood farm, another sawmill. But make sure something's researching while we have overtime going. Come on, come on, come on. I'm not sure it costs us for a sawmill that much. Uh, I don't want to break any wood. That looks pretty good. Okay, and we'll just drag a road all the way to there. Done. So that research finished. Need new book of laws. Radical treatment, sustained life. Listen, everyone. Keep hope new up. Law is signed. Medical posts. People. What is it we need? Isn't it like? Oh. Oh well. I thought we needed something else, but it's not there. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot to provide. Oh, God, that destroyed me. I forgot to do warmth. I forgot to do warmth. Wow, that was painful. Okay, uh, let's go check out the sturdy shelter. We probably need more housing now that these guys brought back more people. So I guess tents, tents for everybody. Tents, you all get tents. Now I'm going to try to run the housing up in one direction because I noticed that if you spread it out, it goes really badly for you, really super fast. What do I need? Uh, that's more than enough. Okay, done. Oh shit, okay, well that's going to be a problem really fast. Uh, hunting post? Food. Hunters post, okay. 
Boom. Boom. Let's get some more of that out of there, shall we? Max that and we'll turn it on. And we'll max that. Leaves us what? Eight people? 23 engineers. And we'll use some engineers there. And we'll use some engineers there because we have so many engineers. We'll use normal people there, plus engineers to gather. They're out of resources, so we can cancel that actually. So hang on, where's our engineers? Two. Alright, we will go none and we'll dismantle this. And we'll put normal people there. Enough for two gathering posts, I said. So we can build another gathering post. Whew! Stress is on. I think we can range of the mine as well. make it up to the mines. I kind of want to have access to the mines. Oh, okay. Food. Bring me food. Cook me food. Cook food. too much coal at the moment. So I don't really care about that at the moment. Whew! This is rough. Uh, okay, so I think I have enough to research the next one too. So I might as well just do these big researches and get them out of the way. emergency supplies we noticed there's a posted heavy rounded door to all scientists if you use any supplies remember to notify the quartermasters upon return to the city this means that there's another city out there signposts by the trail directions